bottom sat a young man old in years. A cheerful smile played on his face, his eyes were filled with tears. As in that crowd he sat alone while he stood up for trial. The judge was all attention, he was sleeping all the while. That poor boy was a rich cashier, his good friends they were bad. The bank he worked for had no funds, and he stole every cent I had. When down the aisle that walked the wreck, an old man bent with tears. He tried to speak, but all in vain, and his words rang out clear. That villain is our only son, the only son we have. And all his brothers, they were good, but he was always bad. And long before that wreck was born, he was our pride and joy. I don't know what he's here for, but kindly hang my boy. End of act first. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the management, I wish to thank you for your liberal patronage here this evening and to announce that tomorrow night, starting with the matinee, we will produce East Lynn with pleasing specialties between each act. Our headliner will be Just Just the Human Face Chicken. As there is only one Wednesday next week, we will give our Saturday matinee then. Each lady, while leaving the theater, will be presented with a souvenir, a beautiful ton of coal. We carry special scenery for this production of East Lynn. I would be pleased to bring it out here and show it to you, but our property man has it locked up in his dress suitcase. I am very sorry to say that he has been off the water wagon for some time now. He is laboring under an impression that because a camel can work eight days without drink, a man can drink eight days without work, so it does not pay to be a goldfish. We will now proceed with the last act of the drama. Thank you. The bank was robbed, the old man said, when the sun was far at sea. And judge is just as clear as much. The villain must be he. Think judge of the families that never saw the bank. They all have lost their savings. They have my son to thank. A scream ran to the courtroom. A woman staggered in. She scarcely weighed 800 pounds. Her face was drawn and thin. She fell exhausted in a chair and fainted with a sigh. And says, judge, I'm his mother. And the villain, he had I. <laughs> My son, my son, the old man cried, forgive me for it all. It was your mother robbed that bank, a bank she never saw. The courtroom seemed to vanish then. I heard the clock strike four. I found I had been dreaming and was sleeping on the floor. Mm-hmm.